Go leave my talk on me. But Jaden and Chase, they have to make the fans them know what really are going on. Yeah, man, move settings, viewers, and subscribers. And we no need no ladder. Gaza Nation, we no find the Gaza Station. Welcome to the channel, a Jaden Chase. And yes, we are bringing on another new and yes, exciting reasoning for the topic of dance hall and entertainment. Mm -hmm. Remember, no man, I'm a remind you now for click the subscribe icon, then the bell icon, and for also leave a like, a comment, and yes, was a shape on the block in truth. Now, viewers and subscribers, we have more accomplishments for shame them. We had some artists recently and them camp at talk about charts and fall off. You notice these artists, viewers and subscribers, music now sell nothing. Color in this life is almost at gold, viewers and subscribers. We are talking about half a million copies being sold. Some artists all them have statements and claims. While their music is not actually doing the numbers, viewers and subscribers. At this point in time, King of the dance hall, the album there should be an album for the history books. In a dance hall music currently viewers and subscribers, I would say Vibes Cartel and his musical endeavors seem to be one of dance hall's last hope for international recognition. I wonder if you hear what I set to know. Big up all other other contributors in a music. But majority of our international household names are from the reggae genre. Talk the truth. Talk the truth. Recently, we see Spice go over there to do it for dance hall music. Big up Spice. You know what I mean? VH1. You know what I mean? She dip on national television in North America. That's a major accomplishment. You know what I mean? But Vibes Cartel was the first dance hall artist to introduce dance hall reality. I always remember that. Teacher's Pet. Vibes Cartel are the first artist to do it. But you don't know Spice do it on a certain level, certain magnitude. Big up Mama. As I said, big up all artists who have played a a role in establishing dance and music internationally. No, we now forget Shabak. I'm going to listen. They have some, inter they have some comment section troll. They're going to jump out. Warm to Shabak and Beanie and... Sh yeah, big up all of who have contributed. We are talking about in these days. With these couple of artists, we say I do it now. We say I must get international contract and nobody even know who Vado is. Vado can still go to the mall. He don't need no security. Nobody know who him be. Vibes Cartel is still the most famous dance artist currently. And the music I do it. The support is sure. Right now, coloring this life at 40 odd million. Same for fever. You know what I mean? The support today. The people actually have purchased the music in this day and age. That's why Vibes Carter is one of the only artists in a dance hall. Also, can never put out album. Such man tried one album and put out. It never worked. If them can't get them can't gather investors for put out even a mixtape again. From them put out them album, what else them put out? Recently, we launched a campaign to try to get a one song and five to go gold. And it not work. See, a color in this life. I bring another gold plaque to dance hall music. Some other artists for lock the chat. Know what I mean? Yeah, them brothers focus more on putting out good music. While this is, you know what I mean, entertaining for dance hall music to hear some artists make some claims. Remember, we have the receipts. And the thing them will not try to purchase. Cause not try to purchase for we are making you realize what you're going on again. There is work to be done before you can reach to that level. That's why when we say this, when some people are going to say vibes cartel fall off, that would be basically saying dance hall music has fallen off. And it's actually the opposite. We see more and more people are paying more attention to dance hall music. And as long as there are fresh ears, fresh eyes, Fresh listeners to dance hall music, then of course that means a vibes cartel fan base just go up some more. Because when you talk about the genre of dance hall music, alright, we got knowledge all of the people who play that contributing role. So we can look for where, where the music are followed from. So we'll see the foundation and we say, alright, alright, big names, big tracks, sampled all around the world, yes. Where is dance hall music today? Where is the direction that dance hall music is going in? Who are the players in a dance hall music war? Steer the direction of dance hall music. Well, we can't even say players are just one player. Vibes cartel alone. Recently, I'm the artist jump out of the box and such, you know. We have a few something with rock, alternative, and goonie. 
And some people say, wait, I want this, I want this for the music. Them they understand the musical contribution from a musical genius. You know, she pop star must have dropped one recently. No, we're not talking about Wayne. Wayne did have an entire album. Lil Wayne and Nicki. No people they even know that Nicki was featured on the album and every single song. Lil Wayne did have a rock album. Yeah man, remember when Lil Wayne has a rock star lifestyle might not make it. Yeah, we didn't know talk about Wayne. We are talking about recent like a couple of days ago. Gonna sign to um young thug them you know what i mean imma weezy fall out of that rock type truck it's a bikers and chains i guess imma say bikers and chains vibes carter got true visionary viewers and subscribers it is not about acceptance we now seek acceptance we are past that point what we are showing is that dance hall is cohesive with all other art forms of music and our contribution should be recognized worldwide. Dance hall music shouldn't be something where people you know mention when they mention reggae. It should be identified as its own art form. And dance hall artists shouldn't need to seek a Grammys where to mark best reggae artists. In no fear. In no fear for your carry my trophy as a dance hall artist and mark best reggae artist. Worse, yeah, bring the trophy back to Jamaica where people identify reggae and dancehall as two different styles of music. If your ears is a reggae party, people will dress different for fall out to a reggae party. Look upon the patrons in attendance for a reggae party. Look at the patrons in attendance for a dancehall party. Short shots, man. Like it stopped right at the way start. A different attire. People conduct themselves different at a dancehall show as opposed to a reggae show these are two different art forms people these are two different art forms just not acknowledge and we can't look upon the international audience for differentiate reggae from dancehall it's up to the people who are now stakeholders in reggae and dancehall the artists and we the fans for differentiate we own music why we need somebody else to tell we say your reggae and dancehall are the same why because of the beats per second don't get technical with me if you get technical with me, dance hall now go one drop. Dance hall now go one drop, one drop a reggae. Don't get technical with me. We are point out the facts though. Talk about it. With you ready like people they ever like when we compare artists to each other. But being to, we talk about two kings who have influenced music locally and internationally. And who their families are now doing the same. Vibes Cartel and Bob Marley. Only see the striking difference between the music now though. So why is it? And remember, Bob has never win a Grammy. Bob never get no Grammy. What them do do is that them give Ziggy them and the rest of the Mali you them a portion the Grammy to atone to the fact that them never did give Bob none. You know what I mean? So them just have portions of Grammys reach um, Bob and him, Bob you them. So them can say alright, the Mali is overall tough gang as a record label overall. I've whole heap of Grammy to them mean. You know what I mean? The producers who have worked with Bob, who work with Marley, them to have the Grammy them. So you know what I mean? The thing look right. But Marley himself never win the Grammy. So think about that, a food for thought. But now we see the striking difference between the music. Man, I'm saying this Vibes Cartel, I wanna dance as last hope for international recognition. I'm gonna nah, stop saying And the album, I'm gonna do it. Other album, I'm gonna do it. And yes, there is an international artist featured on it too. JF, should they pun it too? It should happen. You should happen. The world on itself. We have representation from all over, and these artists, vibes, cartels, and listen out for them. They are game changers in their own respective style of music. Remember that. Remember that. They are game changers. I'm a sita, I'm a sita. I'm them style unmatched, and them not sound like nobody. Most artists are trying to replicate other artists' sound. That is a job for a record label really and truly. You know, so normally a record label tell an artist to try to sing like another artist. These artists have taken it upon themselves to try to sound like a next individual. And then I try to seek their own identity while sounding like somebody else. And when people make the comparison, they feel away. We don't need them have brains. You know. If you ask about Taylor. I don't know, but still not get back the answer. Vice to the one called Jaden Chase, the dancehall correspondent, the Gaza representative. I am reminding you know if you're new to the movement, new to the channel, just a pass through. But you like the reason, of course, to like the point of view. Well, I'm suggesting to you that you click the subscribe icon 
and then the bell icon right after that and put it on all and this is how you know you'll be notified of all fresh content as soon as fresh content is uploaded and made available for you right as upon the platform you know the something of viewers and subscribers and for those who don't first drop a like share the video both icons are in close proximity drop a like share the video tell a friend tell a friend check out the channel check out the vlog join the comment section always home 24 7 never lack yet just be respectful and mindful of the guidelines so that's what we just about the sentiments how oh, move settings fam i wouldn't need a ladder of course and my sentiments are you and yours i'm gonna live love and prosper until we reason again